Hi, this is David with David's Tutorials, and today I'm going to show you a hidden feature in Windows 10. It is the Advanced Renamer Tool. It's already built into Windows 10, so you shouldn't have to do anything. We're looking right now at a screen where I have a number of MP3 files. I have downloaded them from a program I purchased, and I'm going to want to have to rename them so I can see when I look at the names of these files where they came from. The reason I do this is because YouTube wants to be sure that all the music we use in our videos is permissible copyright-wise, and so in the description of my video, tell the people, especially the people at YouTube, where I got the music, then they will have an idea that it is okay for me to use this music in the video. There are many other reasons you may want to rename files. That is just one of them. The best way to tell you about this thing is just to show you how to use it. We have this list of files in this directory. I'm going to select one, hold down the Shift key, and select the top one. Now, somewhere in the middle of this selected batch, I right-click, and that brings me up a context menu. I go to File Menu Tools. I just hover, and it brings over this submenu. And on this submenu, you see there is an item called Advanced Renamer. I click on that, and we have now the Advanced Renamer dialog box. The first thing I'm going to do is select every single file in this list. Click on the first one, hold down Shift, click on the last one, it selects them all. Now that I have selected them all, I'm going to click on Change the Name, and in the String field, I'm going to put what I want to add on to the end of this string. In this case, I'm going to put a dash TS Camtasia, because the Camtasia program is where I got it. Now, if you look the old name is displayed in the first column. The new name, what it will be called, is displayed in the second column. And you see the new name has the old name plus what I put in this field here, the TS Camtasia. And that's all there is to it. I click on the Rename button. I close. And let me widen up this column. And look at there. Every single one of these files has been renamed. That's all I got for you today. Hope you enjoyed this video. If so, give it a big old thumbs up and click that subscribe button and the bell icon if you're not already a subscriber. And we'll see you in the next video.